Hello, hello, welcome back. Wow, we've already made it through one week. <laughs> one week of the year is gone already. Wow, only 51 more weeks to go. <laughs> well, here we are, Monday. Today's Cozy Comforts. We're going to craft a Cozy Comforts collage using images and elements that evoke feelings of warmth, relaxation, and the simple pleasures that bring comfort. And as always, if you want to take it a step further in your journal, write about the significance of cozy comforts in your life. Explore the elements that bring a sense of warmth and well-being, both in your creative space and your daily routine. So I have pre-selected, well, I've torn out some pages with either some quotes or images that I find cozy and comforting. So... I will work on that, and uh, yeah, I have my grandmother's quilt down on the workbench today because we are keeping it cozy. So, let's, and I'll use this book so I can uh, glue and what's not. So I think I want to the, I do like that soup. just below the linen. I like that linen a lot. It kind of reminds me of the linen I used to cover the workbench. So a good thing to remember about cozy comfort is there's also a negative side to comfort as well, as in getting too comfortable and getting stuck in a comfort zone. So it's, it's good to be aware of your comfort zones and uh, Ensuring that you're pushing yourself. Even just, just stick your foot out there into the unknown a little bit more. Amazing things are going to happen. I too need to heed my own advice. <laughs> so, um, that is definitely something I will be doing more this year for sure is pushing myself out of my own comfort zone. Enough is enough. <laughs> Life's too short. We are here to enjoy it and experience it. We are so lucky that we get to experience this existence. And let me tell you, I honestly don't think there could be any better time to be on Earth right now because it's been uh, a lot of popcorn, <laughs> going through a lot of popcorn this last little while, just watching everything that's going on, not literally. So did you get snow where you were over the weekend? In Toronto it just like, it was kind of forecast, but it was snow squall. So it just kind of came out of nowhere on Saturday and then 
Sunday was nice. The sun was able to come out a little bit here and there. This cat here um, looks very much like the cat I used to have. He passed away, uh, I believe it was two Christmases ago now. So. Let me tell you, it was quite the year. I do not wish it upon anyone. However, there's been tremendous growth on the other side. There we go. I just want to see. <laughs> Kitty eating the soup. Yeah, this cat's name was uh, Hanun. And Hanun is Arabic for affectionate. And he was very affectionate. I already had his name picked before I even adopted him. I just, I wanted something unique and different and something that I was identifying with at the time in my life. Neighbors always slamming the doors. <laughs> sleep on my chest, right up on my chest, and around the pillow. Crunch my hair at night. <laughs> Wake me up. When I used to put way too much product in my hair. That's probably why it's missing now. <laughs> All right, what else is cozy here?
keep doing the same thing. Oh. So I can basic knit. I'm better at crocheting than I am knitting. Um, my grandma Dawes taught me how to crochet and I, I think it was Grandma Taylor that showed me knitting. Or I picked it up on my own or something, I can't remember. It's a long time ago, long, long time ago. I even still have the very first crochet hook I was ever given. doesn't like a warm and cozy bundle. Stick that on the couch like it's a little magazine popping out of a blanket. Cozy issue. Because I do like to cozy up with a good book, a good magazine, maybe even a good iPad. <laughs> do some digital reading. Swipe through Pinterest for hours on end looking for ideas. get cozy in the sense of staying in the same place and not going through the door make sure you go through the door get out there experience things enjoy life and push yourself get beyond the edge of your comfort zone That's where greatness happens. All right, I think that is it for today. Thank you so much for joining in today. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and even share this video if you enjoyed it. Um, I love how these are completely different all the time. It's just like a little snapshot and moment in time. If you did a Cozy Comforts collage, please tag me at Nivek Paper. I would love to see what you've been working on and uh, we can share it with others. I do have a group on Facebook that is just specific for this challenge. Um, I post all of the prompts and everything there as well, as, as well as make it available on my website. So whichever is convenient for you, I post it to Instagram as well. So wherever you tend to hang out, uh, you'll be able to see all the prompts there. So, thank you so much. We will...